All right, everybody, my dad's got me picked up here in the bucket. And that hummingbird. I picked him up. <laughs> that was real hard for him. But anyways, um, that hummingbird nest I was showing you guys from the ground earlier. Right now I'm right here below it. Um, and when I stand up, I can see into it. And there's a little tiny baby hummingbird. It's super tiny. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and turn this around and show you. I don't Good morning, everybody. Hope you guys are having a great day. We are gonna do a little bit of yard cleanup. I am here on the tractor. Me and my dad are gonna be working. And one we are- of, One of our favorite things to do together has been work. And so with only a couple days till Blake officially starts his mission, I took the day off so we can work together. <laughs> <laughs> yep. We've always loved working together, get a lot of stuff done together and always had a great time with it. So we got the tractor here under the front trees and we're gonna do a little bit of tree trimming today using the bucket um, and the Sawzall that my dad's got. We're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna, I'm gonna drive real quick right now. I'll flip this camera around as I lift him up um, and we'll trim some branches. There's some branches we gotta trim before we can even fit the tractor right under this. Um, we can actually take this thing down, which is pretty convenient for storing or anything. Um, we can take it down. I don't so. know how we survived without a tractor. <laughs> We've done so much I know. with this little Solace tractor in the past few days that it's like, how did we survive with that one before? This is awesome. Seriously. Um, we've All loved right. it. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and turn hey, this everyone off. Take note. Turn around. I'm going to go to work while Blake videos and drives the tractor. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to be working the tractor <laughs> so hard. So let me get this thing fired up. Let the glow plugs turn off. It's like a charm. Want higher up or is that good?
My dad's already complaining about having to pick everything up. That's why I have a son. Yeah, he says that's why he has a son. Hey, I'm gonna show him real quick what our trees look like because of the power lines. All right. So because we have power lines that run by, they had to literally cut our trees almost in half right here. And then they left the bottom ones out. And so, from ways out, you can see just how terrible it looks. They, they have to maintenance these power lines every so often. And this year, it's probably the worst they've ever looked afterwards. And so we're gonna try to clean them up, make them look the best we can, considering what they look like now. So the plan is to kind of trim these back a ways so that hopefully it grows just kind of into that um, instead of just being out here, just a few branches drooping down real low and trim them up so they go in better and together with these other ones. The Solus tractor has been awesome. They said it could hold 1,300 pounds and now I believe it. What? <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's pretty impressive. This bucket can hold 1,300 pounds. That's what it's rated for. We haven't held that much in it, but we have held some pretty heavy loads already. All lots of manure, wood chips, all kinds of stuff. Yeah. Well guys, while my dad is over there trimming, I want to come show you guys something. See this right here that my finger's on? It looks almost like a knot in the wood. That is actually a hummingbird nest. Um, I don't know exactly how they make it. It looks like it's literally glued together just paper and stuff but anyways we've had a hummingbird in this for the past while i believe the babies are hatched and possibly even grown up um, because it's been here for at least a month that's when i found it um, but anyways i do want to get up there with the tractor and just look and see from the top if there is some but we're going to be very careful with the branches around this to make sure nothing's disturbed in there Blake felt bad I was doing all the work. Just kidding. So, he's going to take a turn, actually. Super fun. Do you want to go all the way back to the tree? Oh, perfect. See the one that's dead right here? Oh, yeah, right there. Oh, that's that's oh, awesome. Yeah. Well, let's go. Just hold on. I'll go over the next one. The next tree. All right, everybody, my dad's got me picked up here in the bucket and that hummingbird. I picked him up. <laughs> that was real hard for him. But anyways, um, that hummingbird nest I was showing you guys from the ground earlier, now I'm right here below it. Um, and when I stand up, I can see into it. And there's a little tiny baby hummingbird. It's super tiny, 
Um, but I'm going to go ahead and turn this around and show you. I don't know how old they are. I've never really, I've only seen baby hummingbirds one other time, but there's only one in the nest. I don't know if that's common, um, but I'll go ahead and flip it around. And we can talk about it as I have it turned around. All right. So here's the nest. And there. The lighting is going to be tough. But there's the baby hummingbird. If you can see it. Now you can see the little baby hummingbird. So now that you've seen that little hummingbird, uh, you can tell it's pretty fragile and small. So we're gonna go ahead and stay away from all of these branches. Um, they're all actually high enough um, that we don't even have to worry about them, but we're gonna stay far away from them so we don't um, shake the nest around or anything um, that would hurt the baby but it has been fun to see the hummingbird come in every once in a while and take care of its little baby hummingbird so uh, we'll leave these alone and get back to work it's looking better around here and it's cleaned up now he's got a ton of stuff we gotta haul away but anyway having this bucket is just awesome because it's a, like a movable ladder all right now my dad is going back around the house and i am going to take care of some of this stuff up over my truck i'll go ahead and just cut it basically right over the truck bed so it falls right into the truck and will be already loaded to haul to the barn or to the goats and animals um, so I'm going to go ahead and cut some stuff while he drives the tractor around the house. That's working great, bud. That lifts up those branches a lot. Yeah. It looks great. In the yard having the tractor was perfect out here by the road the trucks working even better just because we can cut it and load it all at the same time this is looking good bud thanks should i chop all these off so they're like right here uh sure i like your idea we'll see if it works <laughs> It's nice that you have a truck that uh, is made out of real metal and it's old enough that you don't care if something falls on it. I know. Everybody. the sun is bright out it's a beautiful morning but my eyes are watering because the sun is so bright but as I was editing this video I realized that they didn't show you the finished pro finished product so I'm actually coming outside to show you what our trees look like right now and I'm looking at them and I think they look a lot lot better but you know what I loved that video today because Sorry, I'm emotional. I love that Alan and Blake love to work together. Sorry. Anyways, it's been a tender week. We're about a week behind on videos and, or a week ahead, I guess I should say. So 
today when this video goes out when you see it blake is actually doing his at home missionary training experience for a week i'll post a picture right now of what he looks like and when you see the grin on his face you'll realize how happy he is and i'm so proud of him but i'm glad we had this video of blake and alan working because they truly have loved working together and it's been been tender over the years to see them wake up in the morning like let's go work <laughs> let's go do something together they like to have fun together too but work work is an important part of their life that they just enjoyed so i'll flip the camera around show you these trees it really does look a lot better i'm going to take you down to the barn my hair is blowing in the wind <laughs> I'm going to take you down to the barn and maybe the goats will be eating some of the leaves still. You can see see the animals for today. Chores have already been done. Um, but thanks for watching everybody and God bless. What do you guys think? Do you think it looks better? I think it looks a ton better. It looks like it's more filled in up there. Not that L shape cut out that they had done when they had cut it for the power lines. I think it looks a ton, ton better.